attributes of big data. So I will talk about attributes of big data or challenges of big data. Now I am asking a question, is big data all about size? Or how big is big data you think? Think about it. I mean in other words, is 1 kilobyte big data? Is 128 kilobyte big data? It's not just about the size, but size is one of the criteria to term as big data. When we carried a floppy disk back in our school days, for example, one floppy disk was storing 1.4 MB, right? Now, if you have to store 10 MB, what did you use to do? Now, if you have to store 10 MB, what did we use to do? We used to buy 10 floppy disks. So, if you have to store like 1 GB, then we couldn't, right? Because we couldn't buy so many floppy disks, and then what are the problems that we saw? We need to buy more than 100 floppy disks to store that kind of data, right? And the second problem is you need to manage floppy disks. So we then moved to compact disk. We used to buy compact disk used to store data. Then we used to go to hard disk. Now a hard disk can store 1 TB of data, 2 TB of data on an average price. Now I am going to ask you the second question is, I terabyte big data for you? What is your answer? Think about it. Not necessarily. It's very simple. Your term data is big data when you can't manage it. If you are effectively store 5 TB, buying 5 hard disks and effectively retrieve the information that you want from the 5 hard disks whenever you want it, then it is still not a problem for you. Let's say 50 TB is big data for you. You will go ahead to the supermarket, buy like 50 hard disks of 1 terabyte each and you might store the data. But would you able to get data when you want? You need to plug each and every hard disk to the computer and then check for the data, right? It's going to take time. It's going to be pain. Now you are moving from easy to manage to be managed environment. Now your problem moves that environment. That's when we pass through, this is my big data. I need to handle this. So big data doesn't give you a number. It's a relative measure of your system capabilities of handling the size of data that you want to store and process. So somebody come to you and ask you, 500 terabyte is big data? It depends whether the infrastructure can manage it easily or not. 500 TB was not big data 10 years ago. 500 TB is not big data even today. We will come to it. So size is one of the criteria to term data as big data. But size itself is a subjective criteria which depends upon infrastructure that you choose to handle the data, to process the data. But in digital world, data is increasing in size too much. We are getting exabytes, gigabytes data. In the 2005, 130 exabytes of data were created and stored. 1.2 gigabytes of data were created and stored in 2012. And it is expected that 35 gigabytes of data were created and stored in 2020. So data is growing exponentially. So size is one of the criteria for the big data. This is all about the volume of the big data. Volume is one of the attribute of the big data.